Alright. I got my box of seeds and my my sangria, which is quite possibly the most important part of gardening in the humid summer. Looking good, ladies, looking good. So I already planted some of those vinca and uh, some kalima. Yes, I put kalima beans in here. So I don't think I'm gonna sow anything else here. There's um, one cucumber that I don't think is gonna make it. And there's those marshmallow plants still in here as well as a few echinacea that uh, are young enough that now that there's more light, they'll probably start to get a little bit bigger. This bed could definitely use a good weeding so i think if we come in here weed this out we might have some space to plant a few things feels so bad when I'm trying to get through here and these beautiful bees are always all over the echinacea. I'm sorry guys, I gotta move ya. I'm sorry. I gotta clear, I gotta clear this out too. I gotta just gotta weed. We can definitely pull the old lettuce out of these lettuce bowls and sow new lettuce, so we can at least do that. Let's take a look here. I pulled out all of the old lettuce that was growing in here and loosened up the top of the soil. I'm now just gonna take this masculine lettuce mix and sprinkle it over the top, water it in with my watering can, and uh, just make sure that this stays really, uh, really moist the next few days, which shouldn't be a problem with all this humidity, right? Uh, but basically make sure that this stays wet so that the seeds can germinate. that I've got in my garden here. It reseeded from last year's fennel, obviously. <laughs> oh, I love what weeding a space, uh, what you end up finding. I forgot that I had onions in that back corner, so uh, I don't think they're gonna bulb into much now, but now that this is mostly weeded, and I still have a few random ones in here, um, but I got a better idea of the space now. I appreciate that the status was a strong enough plant to really uh, thrive amongst all of these taller weeds. I definitely need to come in and cut back a lot of the status that's um, that's just old and really come back in here and deadhead it. And then as far as other vegetables that would grow well amongst it, probably, I mean, I've got the zucchini there. Maybe I leave that. That'll really fill this space in here and just leave it, leave it as is and just keep this mulched and keep it deadheaded because if that zucchini, maybe I pop in a few more zucchini seeds just in case this one doesn't do so hot. Maybe we do that, but other than that, I'm gonna leave this space as is until the status is done and then maybe we can plant something. But I think the status might last all the way into the fall. All right, so I've got my seeds here. I'm just gonna poke them in. All right, I'm noticing a theme here. I'm getting in here and I'm weeding everything out. Then I'm stepping back to take a look and I'm like, I don't think there's room. <laughs> as much as I want to jam pack this garden full of awesome plants, I do not think there is room. And it's because of myself. So once we get the last two cabbages out of here and this uh, worm ridden cabbage, we'll open up some space, but I am letting this lettuce go to seed and that's taking up a sizable amount of space so uh there will be space soon 
but there will not be space right now. So I think that's it. I think I've done all that I can do for today, guys. So thanks for hanging out with me and we'll catch you next time.